Hi guys, I'm uh, still on the MBD. I'm gonna postpone the seas. <laughs> Never gonna look the same, but I did prevent it from getting worse. So you can tell when I've got my finger right underneath it how bad it is. as I can. She's not opening her mouth right now. She don't have any more teeth. They're gone. So I'm going to have to make sure her food's in smaller pieces than they be. I did take some iodine, not concentrated, mixed in with water on a Q-tip, and that helped. And then I got a 26 watt UVB light and powdered calcium. Yes, this is what I was dealing with for the week, so that's why I didn't make any feeding videos. Poor girls. I would show you the inside of her mouth, but I just, you know, I'm gonna force it open. Look at Tank. Okay, this top bed's in here temporary. And she don't want anything to do with it. <laughs> she is old. She's like four years old. this out of the way. <laughs> she seems interested. She licked it. It's very hairy. She's not used to that. She's used to being a pestitarian. I believe I said that right. Now they eat insects only. And they do eat veggies. So she's not used to doing this. And some breeders do this. She's trying to give it kisses. Alright, I'm going to let her be. And if she eats it, she eats it. If not, she might try to mutter mother it oh man look at that he's eating it wrong 
I think. Yep. Eat it totally. So what I'm going to do guys to um, kind of buff him up a little, kind of get him a little fat. Next week I'm going to give him two mice. Like I've done Lucy and he'll gain weight. He's having tr trouble actually eating because he's so used to Lawrence giving him pinkies, which is totally wrong. And Lawrence has been in this business for 30 years. He knows what he's doing is wrong. There was no excuse for that. He even told me, depending on the size of your snake, is how you feed it. So that don't justify him in any way. The fact is, I've been so lenient on some things. Like, you know, trying to give him the benefit of the doubt. But to do that to a snake is cruel, just to save a few dollars. I'm going to update you guys in a minute. There we go, guys. He's finishing up. And my little girl got scared to death of the mouse. She wanted me to pick her up, so I'm going to remove the mouse. Poor baby. She's never fed anything like that, so she don't know. <laughs> She's only fed insects and vegetables. Oh, and if you guys want to comment about her, I just found out what she is. She's a German giant bearded dragon. Can you believe that, guys? Alright, there we go. Well, he got done eating. I'm going to feed another animal tomorrow. Lucy. And I got her a good water bowl. Which I'll have to upgrade in the next two weeks. That's fine. I got two hypes. And something to help rub their, um, maybe that'll help rub his eye cap off. That little piece of driftwood. Alright. Be back tomorrow to feed Lucy. I went ahead and just fed him this. It's not going to be much nutrition. I mean, after all, he is a big snake. But he did get a jumbo mouse and a fuzzy, so. It shouldn't take him too long to eat this. So I'm going to give him a minute. Look at that, guys. Could you imagine someone feeding him a pinky? And you could see him doing that to a mouse, like a baby, fuzzy. Like, you see how little that thing is? Mm -hmm. And then they're giving him a large pinky? That's not food. That's like a, when you go out to eat and you get an appetizer. Mm -hmm. And you get like six little cheese sticks. And then going back home to sleep. <laughs> Does it fill you up? No. Was it your entree? No. It's good to feed them regular sized mice. Even if your money hurt. Because in the end, you're getting money from the snake. And that's all he really cares about. Me, on the other hand, I care about these animals. Like, I'm dealing with something right now with Zelda. It's heartbreaking. She has MBD. Metabolic bone disease. I had to change dramatically everything. From her lighting to putting calcium on her food. She, she 
did eat a little bit last night, but she's just not crazy about it. So, probably tomorrow I'll get some liquid calcium. He wants to eat that in the middle. Look at that, guys. He thinks he can crush it into two and eat it. Oh my gosh, snakes are funny. This guy is so cool. On the way home, he literally chilled. He didn't strike, bite, or nothing like Medusa. Medusa was a handful. And sadly, she just got to the point where she wasn't eating anymore. I knew if I continued keeping her, she would lose weight dramatically. So, I had to take her back. And someone else got her. So, hopefully, they'll take really good care of her. And I got my newspaper just in case he might have mites. He might not. I don't know. We'll see how that goes. I didn't see any. But mites do tend to hide. So, if that's the case, I know how to take care of them. So, I'm not really worried about that. And if it gets really bad, I'll, I have a cage I can put them in to separate them for the time being. But I'm going to let him be. As you guys see, he thinks he can take the whole thing and cram it down his mouth. Poor guy. Also, while I'm at it, let's, let me show you. So, as you can see, her back leg right there is swelling. And that's not normal. Now, I did soak her in iodine peroxide. But I don't want to hold her because the disease is kind of contagious. And holding her could lead to the other reptiles like beardy lizards are more prone to get MBD than others. It's very contagious. So I'm not holding her as much. I did have to take her out, however. And I did have to wash my hands and stuff afterwards. So yeah. Try not to stress her out by holding her. Try not to hold her as often because it's contagious. And it's very bad for my other animal, bearded dragon, to get. Because it's even more certain bearded dragons. But she seems to be doing better. Her lip isn't as swollen as it was, just her back leg is now. And her finger is messed up, but I mean, it went down, so it's not swollen as bad. And see where the patch is missing on her food? That's where she's ate. So she's eating. Tonight I'm going to take that out, though. There we go. And I'll let you guys go, and... I don't think Lucy's ready to eat yet, so I'm going to just go ahead and post this. Please hit that like and subscribe button. And I'm going to try to do more videos. I know I haven't been here lately. Yeah,